Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Waalaikumsalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Very good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Are, good morning. We are talking about multiple regressions by using metric approach. Okay. Now I want to show you uh, how to calculate the parameters manually by using matrix. Okay, suppose we have here uh, our data. Okay, here dependent variable y. Okay. Y is two. Okay. Now, okay. Suppose the the data as follows. Okay, suppose we have uh, uh, 16 samples. Okay, now we... <clears throat> Okay, now according our beta uh, <coughs> prime beta x prime x in first point of beta, <coughs> we have here the component of x prime x <coughs> matrix. <coughs> yeah, okay, so we have x prime x matrix here. Okay, here x prime x matrix is this is a sample size, the first. First row and first column, uh, A11, A12 is sigma x2, A13 is sigma x3. Okay, now <clears throat> we will have to calculate this uh, summations of our variable here. <clears throat> okay, we, <coughs> okay, let me make it bold. Okay, <clears throat> okay summation of uh, y. before x2 and so on. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> now we have to calculate uh, x2, x3. Okay. This is multiplication x2 and x3. <clears throat> so we have to calculate x2 square. x3 squared, x3 squared, and we have x3 squared. This paper can make it square. Okay. Center. 
Okay, we check our formula to make sure that uh, our calculation is, is correct. Okay, this one x2, x3 minus 2, c minus 3. Okay, here we have uh, sigma x2 square, sigma x2 x3, sigma x3 square. Okay, and then if we want to calculate a uh, uh, variant, we have to uh, calculate y, y prime y. Like here, y prime y here. This one, y prime y. Yeah, y prime y minus beta prime x prime y. Okay. <clears throat> then we have here y prime y. This means sigma y square. Square the y. Okay. okay. <clears throat> now we have to calculate uh, determinant x prime x. Okay, and we have to calculate inverse x prime x. <clears throat> okay. Here uh, I have to write down here x prime x. Okay, the component x prime x is <clears throat> Here, this is n here, uh, sigma x here, x2. Here, sigma x3. Okay. Here, uh, sorry. Sigma x2 here. <clears throat> yeah. Sigma x2 square. Okay. Here. Sigma x2 x3 here. Okay. Okay. This is in mat metric notation. Okay. It is not easy to write down in Excel, but. Uh, I mentioned you that is in, in metric notation. Okay, it is better to move it up here. <clears throat> this means here sigma x3. Okay, here sigma x2 x3. Here sigma x3 square. Okay. I said already that this is symmetry matrix. Okay, here, sigma x2, I will make it bold here. It's same as here, okay. And here, I make it uh, italic. It's the same as here, okay. And here, same as, I make it italic and bold here. <clears throat> same, this is symmetric matrix, that means, if I give you the metric upper triangle or lower triangle, okay, don't answer that you cannot calculate the betas. Okay, just copy from up, from for example, uh, sigma x2, you can use uh, in the upper and down, lower part of uh, the triangle matrix. Okay, now. <clears throat> I have to okay to copy from here n n is fifteen okay because sample size is fifteen okay and here sigma x two this one sigma x two okay here, here sigma x three okay and sigma x two square it's better to set here in <coughs> freeze here. Yeah. Okay. Uh, here is sigma x2 square. Copy from here. And here sigma x2 x3. Okay. And last one is sigma x3 square. Okay. This one uh, upper triangle metric. So you copy from here. Okay. Oh, sorry. From here, yeah. and you copy here from this, this one. You copy here from another one. Okay. This is uh, 
symmetry metric. Okay, symmetry metric. Okay, next step is to calculate the cofactor and minor. Okay, here we uh, CIJ. CIJ. Okay, this. Okay, okay. Be <clears throat> your attention, please. Okay, first we take this one. 15 if we uh, take line to the right okay this mean this one is a part of 15 also we take down this is a part of 15 sorry okay this one part of 15 this mean we write down here okay okay from here Another one from here, we copy it okay, here, and then this one and the partner. Okay, okay, finish. The second one, look at the second one. Okay, I copy here. I want to show you how to take the okay, sorry, actually, this is a special paste, paste special here. Uh, we need only values, <clears throat> okay? Uh, now we take seven three three. This means we take the line here, vertical and horizontal. <clears throat> yeah, sorry. Okay, this means here we take the number this one and it partners here and another one here from here okay and from this one okay next is to take uh, the last element okay okay now we take this one a11 one, one, a13 here this means it's a bowl here you cannot take this uh, member of this uh, part. Okay, <laughs> this means we take yeah. Okay, it's partner here. Okay, you can copy. <laughs> okay, finish. Uh, for the first row. Okay, now we take the second row. Okay, second row here. This means. Uh, we take here 15 uh, it is impossible because it's a part, uh, part of a uh, second row okay this means we take this one okay here i put it here okay i copy from here and another one from here okay uh, okay now from here And from here, okay, we finish. Okay, same. If you see here, we can uh, calculate the same thing. Okay, you can see from here, same. Okay, <clears throat> and from uh, a two two, this mean we have here fifteen, and another one here. Here we have this one and this one. Okay. <coughs> and for A23, okay, A23, this one here. And from here. Okay. Okay. The last one, because it is a symmetry metric, you actually you, you do not need this one. Okay, you can copy from here. Okay, but uh, let me show the same thing. Uh, last one here, uh, A33 here. <clears throat> A33, this means uh, we take here, A33, this one. And it partners here, this one. And take here. Okay. 
okay <clears throat> this is in metric okay from here but it is not easy to write down for how to make a matrix here okay here okay this is the terminal here terminal this means we can uh, take the left border and right border okay uh, this means it's the terminal <clears throat> okay the terminal means that cij here okay this means this one yeah, multiply by this one minus okay this one multiply by this one okay remember okay here this one is a11 here a11 a11 this mean uh, minus one okay here minus one minus one to the power two this mean is equal to one okay Okay, yeah minus one to the power two because uh, the this uh, calculation is uh, placed at the uh, first rows first row and first for first column okay here here is a one two this mean minus one to the power three one plus two three that's mean is equal to minus one so here we have minus here okay don't forget to calculate minus one here this mean here this part multiply by this part minus this one multiply by this one okay don't forget we have here minus one okay this one because we have in minus this mean we multiply this one with <coughs> uh, minus one okay sorry minus one <clears throat> we have positive here okay here from here because here is uh, minus one to the power four why four because one plus three is four okay because here a one three this mean minus one to the power four this means it's a positive here <clears throat> okay we calculate this one okay this one minus this one multiplied by this one okay here i want to show you the same thing here this one multiplied by this one minus this one multiplied by this one must be the same as this this one okay <coughs> okay here multiply by this one <coughs> minus Okay. this one multiplied by this one because we have here a negative power a negative sign here we multiply by minus one okay this three three oh sorry let me check okay. again <clears throat> here seven three three is a correct here one six oh my god we have same thing here actually here to the oh this is wrong number here this is uh two three x two time x three this one sorry <clears throat> okay this one must be the same <clears throat> Okay, let me check here. 
this one 15 here. We have this one and this one. Here we have this one. Okay, this one. This one. Oh, this should be here. This one 15 here should be 15 here. A12, oh no, this one is correct here, it's correct here, correct here, correct here. Okay, this is correct. This one, okay, this one is correct here. This one, okay. Okay, here we have uh, this one, or like here, or this one, okay. This one from here. Check first. Okay, here. Okay. It's equal to this one multiplied by this one minus this one multiplied by this one. We get this positive. Okay. Because it is negative, we multiply by minus one here. Yes, should be negative. <clears throat> okay. This one same is same thing here. Calculate again. Okay. This one multiply by this one minus this one multiply by this one. Okay. Because it is uh, uh, to the power three, we multiply by minus one here. Okay. Same. Same uh, uh, result, okay? Here we get uh, 733 multiplied by this one minus this one multiplied by this one, okay? Let me finish it, okay? And then, because it's the same here, we can move it from there to here. Now we calculate this one in the middle, a a two two, because a two two is a uh, two two times two plus two is four. This means it's positive here. Okay, we calculate here uh, fifteen multiplied by one uh, one o six something minus this one multiplied by this one. Get here the number here. Uh, here, okay. Because this is a uh, uh, second row and third column. This mean two plus three is five. Five is negative. So we have here fifteen multiplied by this one minus this one multiplied by this one. Okay, because this is the power uh, to the power of five, that means we multiply by minus one. <coughs> okay. Okay. Last one. Last one is uh, a a three three a three three. That means positive. Okay. Uh, this one multiply by this one minus this one multiplied by this one. Okay, and next step is copy from upstairs from here. Okay, and copy from here. 
same thing. Ah, okay, we call it this uh, cofactor. Okay, cofactor. <clears throat> How to, to calculate the uh, determinant? Okay, to simplify this one, let me copy experiments here. Okay, let me copy here. <clears throat> okay, I put it here. Okay, it's a special, special values. Okay, okay. <clears throat> We have determinant yeah, x prime x, determinant x prime x is equal to, okay? Okay, you have to calculate this uh, uh, cofactor with its partner, partner here, okay? If you take first row, second row, and third row of the first column, you have to take the same partner. You can take vertically or horizontally. Okay, suppose here we have the here from here uh, plus, sorry, multiply by this one plus this one multiply by this one plus this one multiply by this one. Okay, we have the determinant uh, to 23 million something. Okay. I want to check another calculations. Suppose we take from here the third rows, third row here. Okay, same. Okay, the same result. Okay, that means our calculation is correct. Okay. Next step is to transpose this CIJ become CJI because it is a symmetry matrix. It is a special case, okay? It is a special case. It is a special case because CIJ is equal to CJI. So we do not need to transpose this one, okay? To transpose this one, it's the same, okay? It is a special case. It is a special case. Where the x prime x matrix is symmetry matrix, so Cij is equal to Cji. Okay, we do not need to transpose the matrix, the Cij. You get it? Mm. Okay. Yes, sir. This is a special case. Not every matrix uh, uh, you let like that. For symmetry matrix, uh, we transpose the same thing. Is as the same. Okay. Now we calculate the uh, the inverse. Inverse. Okay. Uh, x prime x inverse. Is equal to okay. This means we calculate one and this one one of <coughs> sorry determinant x prime x okay multiply by adjoint x prime x adjoint x prime x is a transpose of cofactor. So, because it is symmetry matrix, no need to transpose it. <clears throat> okay, we get here um, x prime x in first is equal to one of a, okay, this one determinant multiply by okay. So I have to write down this here. Is equal to one of a determinant, okay, multiplied by this one okay. because, uh, uh, okay, because determinant is single number, we have to, uh, to make it a uh, 
same for all population. So we <coughs> we make it in uh, <coughs> addition. Okay. And then you just calculate it. <coughs> okay. Okay. Just copy. Okay. <coughs> we have this one. This one x prime x inverse. Okay. What what is beta? Beta is x prime x inverse multiplied by x prime y. Okay, x prime y. We can check what is the x prime y. Okay, here x prime y. This means sigma y, sigma x to y, sigma x three y for uh, <coughs> the three by three matrix. Okay, yeah. Okay, here because it's only one x here uh, this was x the second x can we <coughs> calculate in x prime y this mean uh, x multiplied by y this mean we have here sigma y we get already sigma y we got this is three the 36 hundred already here x x to y x3 y okay we multiply x2 is x3 here okay okay same thing here we can copy to x2 x3 x3 x y here <coughs> okay we have already this one this mean uh, we <coughs> okay this one is x prime y. Okay, we take the value from here, uh, sigma y here. Yeah. Okay, and we have the value of x to y here. Yeah. And another one, the value of x3 y here. Yeah. <coughs> okay, now we calculate x prime x in first with x prime y. This means we have beta here. Beta means from beta 1 until beta 3. Okay, here we right? calculate here. Right? This one. Okay. Multiply by this one. Plus this one. Multiply by this one. Plus this one. Multiply by this one. Okay, this one beta 1. Next is beta 2. This one multiply by this one plus this one multiply by this one plus this one multiply by this one. Now we get with beta 2. And last one is beta 3. This one multiply <coughs> by this one. This is beta 3. Okay, now we have betas, all betas here. And to simplify, we have to transpose it in two digits. Uh, any question? No, any question? No, for now, sir. continue with this one <clears throat> okay there we have to calculate variant of variant beta this one uh, variant of variant beta is sigma square multiplied by x prime x inverse we have already x prime x inverse now we calculate on sigma square sigma square is y, y prime y <coughs> minus beta prime x y from here 
ya y prime y minus beta prime x1 oke okay. okay. now we calculate uh, mu prime mu okay. mu prime mu this mean y prime y we have y prime y here sigma y square this one this one sigma y okay that means sigma this is y prime y uh, beta prime this mean beta here beta here beta this one beta prime okay x prime y this one x prime y This means we have here uh, mu prime mu. Okay. Sorry. I want to show you the formula first. Okay, this one. Uh, y prime y minus beta prime x prime y. This is uh, mu prime mu. Okay. Uh, mu prime mu. Sorry. Yeah, mu prime mu is equal to <clears throat> oh, this one from here. Okay. Uh, y prime one here. Yeah. Okay. Minus. Okay, we have here. Okay. Minus here. Yeah. Okay, and we have here beta prime. Let's mean beta prime. We have this one. We have here this here, uh, and we have this one because we transpose from uh, vector column to be uh, vector row vector from column vector to row vector. We multiply here x prime y. Okay. <clears throat> and then we have the what uh, mu prime mu mu prime mu is equal to this one minus <clears throat> okay this one multiply by this one okay plus this one multiply by this one plus this one multiply by this one okay we have here oh sorry is I think we have to oh my god it should be positive here. this one minus this one time this one plus this one time this one plus this one time this one. Y prime y. Let me check y prime y. Y prime Y. Okay, so correct. Okay. <clears throat> and then sigma square. Uh, it's, it's impossible it's to negative here. Because it's this uh, sigma square should be positive. Y negative here. This one beta prime minus beta prime x prime y. Okay. okay, let me check first. This one multiply by this one. This one multiply by this one. Okay, this one multiply by this one. Okay, we have some mission here. 
be good to this one. Same thing. Okay, never mind. Let me check that. Okay, we have sigma square here. Sigma square is uh, uh, mu prime mu over n minus k. We have n is uh, 15. Okay, 15 minus 3 because we have three betas here. <coughs> okay. And, oh my God, possible this one. Because it's negative here, okay, if negative here, we have uh, x prime as positive here. This means we cannot calculate the uh, standard error of beta. Maybe there is something wrong here. <clears throat> y, yeah. Y squared. Same thing. Y prime Y. Let me check the formula. Y prime Y minus beta prime XY. Score it here. Should be positive here. Beta prime. Beta prime. Okay, here beta prime. X prime Y. Score it here. Because if it is here negative, it is impossible to calculate the variant beta. Uh, we can calculate variant beta, but we cannot calculate the standard error beta. Beta prime. Okay, now uh, wait a for a while. Okay, this one here is correct. X for an X inverse, one by the determinant. Okay, here. This one determinant, the same. It's C44, is correct here. Yeah, the mean uh, for in okay D okay D D here <coughs> X prime Y here. Six ma okay. If we have here X prime, okay, sigma Y, sigma X two. X two Y sigma X three Y is correct here. Okay. Yes. This one from sigma Y. 
let me check this. That is correct, sigma y. This one, sigma x to y is correct. And the one is sigma x three y is correct here. Okay, this one x two times y is okay. This one x. Oh my God! This a uh, sorry. Okay, this from copying here. Actually, this one multiplied by this one. Sorry. Okay, we I okay this one wrong because I calculate from here x two time x three because I copy from uh, the partner here. Okay, sorry. We get the calculation now. X prime y. Yeah, we, we have beta here, different beta. Okay, now uh, y prime y is, uh, sigma square is positive now, okay? Sorry, uh, this is my uh, mistake, okay? Now we have a positive mu prime mu. Okay, now we have variant covariant beta, variant, variant covariant beta, we have variant of variant beta is equal to okay sigma squared. This means sigma. Sorry. Okay, we here yeah, sigma <coughs> square multiplied by uh, x prime x inverse. Okay, <coughs> this is variant of variant beta. Variant covariant beta is equal to okay. We have sigma here, okay. We okay because this is the same value, so okay, let me calculate. Okay, this is same. We have to uh, take this value. No need to change it. Then we multiply by uh, x prime x inverse from here. Okay, and we have this x prime x. This is variant of variant beta. Let me move it here. Okay, sorry, without zero here. Okay, this is uh, variant beta one. This is variant beta two. This is variant beta 3. Okay, we have here variant beta 1 is equal to. Sorry, I have uh, incoming form. Okay, we have now uh, variant of variant beta. Variant beta 1 is equal to uh, okay, variant beta 1 is equal to this one. Okay, variant, 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 uh, beta 2 is equal to uh, A22 two two here, variant, beta 3 is equal to this one, right? A33, three three. okay, now if you want to calculate this, uh, standard error of beta 1 okay standard error of beta 1 okay is equal to okay let me write down the first the three is square root of uh, square root of this one. Okay, we have uh, standard error beta one. Uh, we have to copy to standard error beta three, beta two, and beta three. Okay, now we have 
Alaska, like the beta 3. From beta 1 until beta 3. Okay. If you want to calculate the T ratio, this statistic is equal to yeah, beta of a standard error beta. This means we have here T ratio for T ratio for beta 1. We have T ratio beta 2. We have T ratio beta 3. Okay. This means here we calculate from beta. Okay, we have beta here. Beta this one of a standard error beta. Okay, we have standard error beta here. Okay, we can copy here this one T ratio for uh, all of betas. Now we have, uh, have we have uh, the ratio. We have beta. We have everything here. Okay. Uh, any question until this uh, explanation? No. Any question? Any problem? <laughs> Like I wonder, do we have to do it uh, with Excel also if we have to do something like this? Okay, actually it is manual. Manually, mm -hmm. I, I I show you how to calculate manual. But if we calculate manually, we uh, spend more time. So I show you how to calculate this manually. But I use Excel. Okay, because I have no whiteboard, it is not easy to write down for every element of the matrix. Okay? <clears throat> okay, now, because we have already and variant covariant beta, we have also uh, okay. Now, hypothesis testing, we have uh, T ratio, we calculate already T ratio. Now, we have to calculate F statistic f statistics here uh, beta prime x prime y minus n uh, y bar square okay now we calculate here by using same thing here okay now we have to calculate uh, y bar y bar is sigma y we have already sigma y here from here divided by sample size sample size is 15 so we have here my bar okay and <clears throat> we have to calculate the is square okay or y bar square this mean y bar square is equal to this one we have to square it this one y bar square now, according to the formula, beta prime x prime uh, y. <clears throat> we have already beta prime x prime y here. Beta prime x prime y here, this one. This one is beta prime x prime y. Okay. Okay, but this means uh, we have uh, beta prime x prime y is equal to okay we copy from here this one beta prime x prime y okay and then we have uh, n multiplied by n l oh, sigma oh, sorry n with y square y bar square okay <laughs> We have n is 15 here. This one y bar square. This means upper part of f. Yeah, okay. Upper part of f. 
is equal to okay uh, beta prime x prime y minus n multiplied by six uh, y bar square okay this one upper part okay let me show you the formula again <clears throat> yeah this one upper part now we have down part okay no no sorry uh, we have to divide it by n minus k minus k minus one that's mean we have to divide it by uh, k minus one that's mean we divide it by sorry here we divide it by uh, k minus one k is three uh, minus one but that's mean uh, two okay this one upper part now we we have to calculate the uh, lower part of the f y prime y minus beta prime x prime y we have this one Min n minus k this one is uh, this one is sigma square okay you can see the sigma square same this yeah sigma square from here this one Sorry, sigma square. This one, sigma square. Okay, sigma square is uh, beta prime x prime y. Okay, y. Sorry, y prime y minus beta prime x prime y. <coughs> this means sigma square. This one, sigma square over n minus k. Okay, we have already this one. Okay. Sigma square, we have this one because it's, we divide it by n minus k. Okay, you can see the formula here. Okay, this means the lower part f is equal to this one. Okay, this means f statistic. Okay. Is equal to this one divided by this one. Okay, this we have this F statistic. Okay, this is how to calculate the parameters and the statistic of a multiple regression model using matrix approach. No question. No. I think I think in the formula you have that that sigma square divided by n minus k, but you just copied sigma square and you did not divide. Okay, it. let me show you. <laughs> okay, okay, here sigma square this one. Okay, sigma square. I already divided by n minus k, fifteen minus three. Okay. You see? Yeah. yeah okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let's say correct, right? Any problem? No problem, no. Understand. No question and understand. Do you have any question? No? Oh my God. This means uh, it is easy to teach you. Okay? No problem. Even though we have a long calculation okay, from the betas until the F statistic. <laughs> yeah, we have F statistic. Okay, this is uh, ANOVA. Usually I use this one to uh, for the midterm test. Okay, uh, you have to calculate this one. Okay, beta prime, x prime, y minus n minus y bar square. We get already this one. Okay, y prime, y minus beta prime, x prime, y. Okay, this one F. Okay, this one, this one divided by one is a F statistic. Okay, uh, this one time uh, plus this one equal to total. This one K minus one, this one N minus K, total is N minus one. Okay. No, any question? 